There is a massive belief in the fitness industry that you need to lift five to seven times a week for an hour or even two hours in order to get a toned, dense, and powerful body. But that isn't the case at all. In fact, Dorian Yates, who's a six-time Mr. Olympia, only lifted three to four times a week and for 45 minutes, and he arguably had one of the best physiques of all time. Now, there might be some of you screaming in your heads right now. He had his body because he used steroids. But what you need to realize is that every pro bodybuilder uses steroids. In fact, I want you to name one who didn't. You can't because they don't exist. So the question remains, why did he still have a better body out of everyone else who also used steroids? Clearly, there's something else going on. Working out five to seven times a week, even for an hour, is overtraining, and it's going to cause your gains to slow down. And actually, you're gonna get better results from working out three to four times a week. But in order for you to understand why lifting weights three to four times a week is better than five to seven, you need to understand how evolution has crafted your body. Evolution states that you adapt in order to survive. And that's actually why you're able to tan and get darker skin. Your body is adapting from the stress of the sunlight and coming back darker so that the next time the sun won't damage it as much. That's also why if you got sandpaper and were to rub it on your hand, your hand would start bleeding. But after a few days, your skin would come back tougher and stronger in the form of a callus. In fact, that's even why you're able to gain muscle. What's really happening is you're applying stress and breaking down your muscle fibers, and then they're growing and coming back stronger so that next time it can handle the stress you're applying when you lift weights. That's also why when you don't increase the intensity of your workouts, you're going to plateau. It's because your body has already adapted to the stress you're applying to it, so it doesn't need to grow anymore. With that being said, you need to allow your body sufficient rest time so that it can recover and adapt from the damage you've applied. You see, when you lift weights, what's first gonna happen after is that your body is going to go into a recovery phase. And that pretty much makes sure that there's no uh, internal damage or long-term damage happening. But then after this recovery phase, it goes into this adapting phase where you see most of the gains. But the mistake that most people make that you might be making too is that they focus on training and training and training and they don't allow their body to fully rest. So with the little rest that their body does get, it's just focused on that recovery phase instead of adapting, which means your gains are gonna be minimal to non-existent. In fact, you've probably already experienced that yourself, which is why you're watching this video right now. And if you keep continuing on the same path, your gains are just gonna get smaller and smaller. But even worse than that, you're gonna burn out, which is gonna cause internal damage to your body. That's why in the new era of health, we don't spend countless hours working out to get a Greek God body. We only lift weights three to four times a week to maximize muscular and neuro recovery to provide for the easiest and quickest results. Where it's not about training as hard as possible, it's about training as smart as possible. And using evolution and biology to tap into the power of how you are hardwired as a human to force your body to mold into that of a Greek god. And at the same time, you will discover how to send your body extreme signals to melt fat so that you shred your body fat and gain muscle at the same time. But when you learn the same secrets that we utilize in the new era of health, you're going to do much more than just shred into the Greek god body because you're also going to boost your mental alertness, gain godlike energy, and acquire the mind of a conqueror. Because let's be honest, how many times have you told yourself that you're going to start working out or eat healthier, only for you to fall off after a few days or a week and feel terrible about yourself after? That's why in the new era of health, we have you first acquire the mind of a conqueror before you get the Greek god body. So if you're ready to shred into the Greek God body and take absolute control of your life, then click the link around this video. And if you're still watching this video, then I applaud you. You aren't giving up in the journey to improve yourself. I would be ecstatic to have you a part of the new era of health empire. Make sure to crush that subscribe button and like button. And also I wanna hear from you. How many days a week have you been lifting? Let me know in the comments below and I'll see you in the next video.